For the first time in 135 years, the Salvation Army will kick off its Red Kettle campaign early. Yeah, due to the pandemic, demand for services is at an all-time high and it's only expected to get worse. Meanwhile, the Salvation Army is predicting a significant decrease in kettle donations this year. As News Center Maine's Shannon Moss tells us, the organization is launching part of its annual drive now in an effort to rescue Christmas. It's not his usual attire, but when Mark Schapp is volunteering as a Salvation Army bell ringer, this penguin costume is his go-to uniform. It brings joy to my heart to see people uh, wanting to contribute and wanting to help others. That's what it's all about. Schapp has been manning a red kettle for the past 15 years. Over the years, I've collected $125,000. Money that has helped the Salvation Army help a lot of people over the years. This year, the number of people seeking help will be staggering. We're all living in the middle of a book that hasn't been written yet. and uh, But we do know for certain the amount of people coming through our doors and to our doors on a daily basis in need is growing. Salvation Army Captain Michael Harper and his wife Major Armida Harper predict the pandemic will create a 155 percent increase in the need for services this year. You can't turn people away when they're coming to you and they're at the lowest part of their life at times asking for help. Money raised from the Kettle Drive helps people not just at Christmas, but year-round. People can have their rent paid. They don't have to worry about, is my house going to be warm enough for my children? Am I going to have food to put on the table? While the need is tremendous, the Salvation Army is concerned that less foot traffic and less people carrying cash and coins may lead to a 50% decrease in kettle donations. With less kettle money available to help provide Christmas and the need being greater, we have to start that much earlier. As usual, the red kettles will be out in November, but the digital portion of the drive is starting now, something Mark Schaap is excited for. Uh, the Salvation Army is just there for people when they need it most. And that need has never been greater than it is now. In Portland, Shannon Moss, New Center, Maine. And once the bell ringers are out in November, they will be adhering to safety protocols. Meanwhile, there are several ways you can help the Salvation Army now. Just go to our website to learn more about their Rescue Christmas campaign.